Hello everyone. In this video, I will demonstrate how to export and import PLS SCM uh, projects using Smart PLS. So I have this software here. Uh, so I just launched this one. So if you want to launch it again, you just press command space bar and Smart PLS. That's the fastest way to launch the uh, Smart PLS software. Uh, and I'm working on my Mac. So once this is launched, it's gonna show you the project explorer and all the projects that you're working on. Often uh, you work on some projects and you need to export it uh, maybe for storage purposes or maybe uh, for sending it to some other colleagues that you are working with. So I'm gonna show you how you export and import the projects using uh, smart PLS here. So this is one project here, KF, uh, just one random project. I have many models in them. I have a data in, uh, in this particular project and I want to export everything that I have and store it uh, for my later use. So I'm gonna click on this one. I'll just click on this one. I'm gonna say file, export project. And I'm gonna save this one on, let's say my uh, desktop. So I have a desktop here, let's say this particular folder. I'm just gonna save it here as KF here, okay? So if you go here, uh, you're gonna see this as a zip file, okay? So this is how you save the entire project. It has all the models and the data inbuilt in it. So uh, you can email this file to somebody else or you can store it wherever you want. And later on, let's say you want to import it back into uh, your PLS SCM software. So this is the way you're gonna do it. Let's rename it. Uh, I'm just gonna rename this one because I already have the project by the same name. I'm just gonna call it underscore one, okay? I'll go to PLS SCM software here. Um, I'll go uh, to file import project from backup file that's the option I need to choose and uh, it directly take me to that folder otherwise you can browse through it you can go to the desktop here and this is the folder and that's a file which I just exported uh, exported it so I'm just gonna double click on it you can give a name to you want so I'm gonna just retain the same name I'm gonna say okay. So as soon as you do that, you have everything that you're looking for in here uh, on your machine, on your uh, smart PLS software. So again, you might email this zip file, uh, this zip file to somebody else and then probably he can download the zip file on his or her computer and import it and start working. So this is pretty handy. Uh, it has all the data that you're looking for and it is good to go. So this is just a demonstration how to import and export um, projects using smart PLS software. Thank you very much for watching.